Well, hello everyone. This is uh, this is uh, Vital Bullet. Yes, I am Vital Bullet, the president of e Easy, and I'm and I'm coming here to to, to take over for Kushakus and tell you what uh, with today, 13th of uh, on Friday. Okay, 13th of June. It is June. I mean not June. I mean uh, not uh, anyway. On this day. Uh, we have we have incepted Battlefield 3. Yes, from now on, Easy will be taking over Battlefield 3, and uh, we are gonna have like epic outfits. We are gonna introduce field grenades. We are gonna introduce portable tanks, which you can like spawn whenever you want to. Also, helicopters and orca fighters. Yes, orca orca helicopters with uh, napalm in them. Yeah. This is gonna be very fun f uh, for everyone, and uh, I assure you that this spells a great times for battery free. It's gonna be really epic. We also want to introduce horses. Yes, from now on you can be you can be a, a mounted rider. Right, exactly, a mounted rider. You can like uh, you know uh, uh, use a sword, and you can mount a horse, and you can like you know charge on your enemy. And but my my, oh, my my throat is hurting right now my throat is hurting right now from making this announcement yeah uh that was obviously not <laughs> vital bullet <laughs> it, it was just me goofing around well anyway guys i just found out that uh for a couple of days i think it's uh, till like 15th or 16th of this month battlefield 3 is like uh battlefield 3 premium account uh, is uh, like uh, at a discount. It's like uh, I don't know 15 euros or something like it So uh, if anyone is interested in buying premium, I guess that this is one of the best moments to do it Yeah, uh, I don't know if I would uh, advise it cuz uh, I just did it. Uh, I just uh, did it Okay, I just did it. I just QQ'd about it in the Polish commentary I was trying to join some infantry servers. That is my only filter when I'm uh, looking for servers infantry filters and every freaking server was empty whenever I would join it would be either empty or maybe I don't know three four players would be in it so uh, there was no sense uh, playing and uh, I was uh, forced to join a high-ranked uh, friend of mine I don't even remember his name I'm sorry I'm sorry uh, and uh, as you can see uh, I wasn't doing too well I, I actually d deleted the rest of the footage because uh, I was getting spawn raped all the time. I, I just couldn't handle high level play. I just I just couldn't do it without 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 some serious help. I just cannot I just cannot play on uh, such servers. I just couldn't do it. So uh, yeah, I I guess. But if you are a really big fan of Battlefield 3, if you have already purchased it, I mean purchased it. If you have already downloaded it a couple of days ago when it was available for free, and if you want to go premium. Now is the best time to do it. Other than that, I don't know. Maybe you guys will do it. Maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know if this game will be featured heavily on my ch on my channel. Because, uh, quite frankly, I was thinking about introducing some other titles. Because, uh, you know, uh, Battlefield 3 is... Uh, yeah, it is a classic, but it is kind of yesteryear. So, uh, right before I started recording my commentary, I mean, uh, right before I started recording these rounds, I'm doing a post commentary, obviously. I I signed for the close beta tests of Battlefield Hardline. Yeah, I don't know anything about the game, other than my friend Mervo, uh, you know, the Polish Battlefield Heroes YouTuber who just uh, kind of quit. I mean, a couple of weeks ago he kind of quit on Battlefield uh, Heroes. I mean, he's still recording it, but uh, he kind of switched to Battlefield 4, and now he is like advertising Battlefield Hardline as the next Battlefield Heroes. And I don't know why, because uh, Battlefield Heroes is a cartoon shooter, and Battlefield Hardline doesn't really seem like a cartoon shooter. The graphics are kind of realistic, like in Battlefield 3 and Battlefield 4. But anyway, he uh, he's doing some videos about the game. Uh, the game is in the closed beta phase, and I signed for the closed beta uh, test uh, testing. So, uh, yeah, uh, if I get in, expect some commentaries, probably live ones, uh, maybe some post commentaries too. I don't know, for some reason I just cannot concentrate on my gameplay, uh, I, I, I mean on my commentary and my gameplay too, while doing both. Uh, 
while playing Battlefield 3. Uh, those games, uh, I mean, it's such a, it's such a different animal uh, to me that I just cannot do it. But I don't know if the game, if the game, if Battlefield Hardline is a derpy game, is a funny game, and I saw some Easter eggs and they were kind of funny, you know, like you approach, uh, okay, you approach a box with some donuts. And your your hero goes like, holy shit, there's some donuts in them, Urgh, there's some donuts, and yeah, that was kind of funny. So uh, I don't know if the game is derpy. Obviously, you know uh, the game. Wow, well, if the game is derpy, it's kind it's kind of like putting me in this mood, in this like vibe when I really want to do a lively commentary, live commentary, a lively commentary. Okay, not just a live commentary, a lively commentary. Uh, that's why I'm doing uh, live commentaries from Battlefield Heroes. I don't know, it, the game is just so derpy that uh, I, I, I just, I'm just always able to like deliver a pretty nice commentary from it. And that is not the case with Battlefield 3. I don't know, maybe the game is just not really my forte. I mean, it's not really my thing. I have never played games like these. So yeah, anyway. So Battlefield uh, Hardline, if I get uh, to the close beta phase, I will do some commentaries from it, but uh, that is not the case. Uh, of the, I mean, that is not the point of today's commentary. I mean, it's it's it kind of is, you know. It's one of the points of today's commentary. It's one of the things that I that I wanted to address in today's commentary. Uh, listen up. Uh, I was thinking about uh, purchasing Battlefield 4 uh, and Titanfall, like like for real, like for shizzle, like for shizzle my dizzle, okay. I will put some drizzle over the hizzle for my shizzle dizzle nizzle nigga. Something like it. I, I'm, I'm seriously considering buying Battlefield 4 and Titanfall. But the problem is, I don't know if my uh, equipment can run it. I have uh, GeForce uh, 560Ti. Okay, it is a pretty old graphics card. I bought it uh, shortly after uh, Skyrim was released. Okay, everyone, uh, everyone here knows Skyrim, right? Uh, the game was kind of... Uh, the game was a huge milestone back in like 2007. No wait, it was like 2011. Yeah, it was 2011. God damn it! Oh, oh my God! Oh, I'm getting senile over the old, over <laughs> the old age. Anyway, so uh, I bought that graphics card two and a half years ago, at least two and a half years ago, and <laughs> it's kind of dated. And I, I, and I, I just don't know if I, I would be able to run Battlefield 4 and Titanfall on a graphics card so old. But uh, if you guys told me that I would be actually able to record it in nice quality, I would be more than happy to uh, purchase those games and start recording commentaries and gameplays. Because uh, I want to, I want to, uh, I want to have more vari variety on my channel. Uh, I tried with loadout; it didn't work out. I mean, the game is kind of shitty anyway. So yeah. Uh, I tried with Team Fortress. I actually really enjoy Team Fortress. I wish you guys liked Team Fortress as much as I do, because uh, the game is fucking, the game is just fucking amazing. But uh, I don't know. It's not the hot shit right now, so yeah, uh, it wasn't really, it wasn't really well received. I, I, I suppose on my channel. But with Battlefield 3, I don't know. I, I think, I think uh, you guys took a liking to it, despite the fact that I suck at it. Okay. Ugh. I never played games like that, like those, but uh, when I, I mean, I mean, I never played a game like Battlefield 3. But anyway, so uh, I was thinking about Titanfall and Battlefield 4. If my PC would be able to handle them, then uh, those games, those games are green, green lit for me. Okay, I'm gonna purchase them because uh, recently I've been getting, you know, a steady flow of cash from my YouTube channels. It's actually really nice. Okay. Uh, it's about three hundred dollars each month, and it's uh, steadily, steadily increasing. And I can easily afford like PC upgrades and uh, new games. But for now, uh, since uh, I updated my PC a couple of uh, months ago with uh, you know purchasing uh, those hard drives, one SSD and one regular, one regular hard drive, you know the, my PC is running perfect, perfectly fine. It, it's able to handle well most games that I've been trying to play, and if I would be able to run uh, Battlefield 4 and Titanfall perfectly on my PC, then uh, I guess I guess uh, you know per purchasing those uh, those games and starting recording commentaries from them would be a good move. Cause uh, yeah, I will I will definitely not be bothering with games like uh, I don't know uh, League of Legends, uh, Dota, and so on. I, 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 the games uh, the rounds are too long. Uh, the games are like too uh, I don't know. 
farming oriented. It's just not for me. I like action, okay? I like action. I like explosions. I like fucking big boobies, okay? I like big boobies. Do you guys like boobies? I like boobies, okay? Obviously, there are no boobies in those games that I just mentioned, but, uh, you know, who gives a fuck, okay? There is still some action in it, okay? It's, it's still, it's almost as good as boobies. Not quite, but, you know, sh show, showing, showing some action, okay? Being all excited and doing it probably with a face cam, because uh, I kind of intend to start doing face cam commentaries. I think it would be a pretty nice idea for, uh, for, uh, for this summer. Yeah, Q&As. Battlefield 4, Titanfall, Battlefield Heroes, Battlefield 3, uh, maybe a couple of other games, like Team Fortress 2, uh, obviously, and fa all, all that done with a uh, with my face cam, okay? That I mean with my face cam, with a with a face cam, okay? So yeah, that's basically the plan. But I really need your input. Would my PC be able to handle uh, Battlefield 4? And I know I didn't really give my specs, cause uh, I I simply don't know what the fuck I I'm running on. I have 8 gigabytes uh, of RAM memory. I have a brand new uh, SSD hard drive uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, Western Digital 2 terabytes. And what else do I have? Uh, you know, uh, my mobile and the processor. I won't even. Ma I don't even have to. Uh, I don't even have to check whether those are like uh, state of the art. Because they are, okay, they, they, they are very much state of the art. It's, it, those are some really good components on my PC. But my graphics card, GeForce, MSI, GeForce 560 Ti. It's fucking old. It's fucking old. And I don't know if those awesome games with awesome graphics uh, will be able to run on my PC. So uh, I kind of would like to like get your opinion on whether I can already start you know, thinking about purchasing those games. Or should I like uh, probably start saving up for a new graphics card. So yeah, that's it for my commentary. Okay, that's it. Okay, that's all I wanted to say. I know it's kind of random and everything, but... Uh, I actually, I actually felt good, uh, you know, doing it. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun. Okay, so guys, uh, till 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 Saturday, I guess I will have two Battlefield Heroes commentaries for you, so you can be all happy. <laughs> Take care, yo.